What's up my friends, 915 Mang here. Today we get to hang out with my buddy D. He has a 400 gallon roof tank, jam packed with corals wall to wall. Uh, lots of variety, LPS, SPS, softies, and tons of movement with these beautiful fish that you just don't see in an everyday reefers fish tank. So kick back, enjoy the video, and take care guys. This of the prices, you know, but it was awesome. My job is about happy with me right now. Either one of them. Heck yeah, I'll kill you. I don't have any luck, but since I switched lights, they seem like uh, my Duncan seem a lot. Yeah, it's massive. You got all the fish local and... No, I couldn't get all the fish local. I'm gonna say, cause this guy is beautiful. And how often do you feed your, your tanks? Every day. Just nori or...? Nori and... I got a special... Uh, a plate food, but they absolutely love it. It's got a lot of mice shrimp in it, uh, spirulinas in it, brine, real fatty for them, keep them good, and it's cheaper. Get it from a guy that makes it in Arizona. Okay. First, I just tested it out, and then they just they go to it. Or if I don't feed them that, I feed them reflux. And I got pellets too. Yeah, I kind of change it up, you know. And I got some greedy fish. Yeah, I was having a problem with just the yellow tang, and but you got all kinds of tangs. Yeah, I got three yellow tangs in there. Uh, orange shoulder, two cell fins, three flamingos, Caribbean blue. Uh, there's two squirrel fish in there. And how long have you been um, in the hobby? Or about two years. Really? So you got you didn't get bit. You got infected by the saltwater bug. Jeez. I just I kept outgrowing everything. Okay, nice. I remember one time I accidentally spilled a whole bottle of calcium. And instead of the tank reacting bad, they just I mean they soaked it. I mean I had. Everybody just sprouting, <laughs> and it was on accident. Before I got all the doses, right now I, I even got the doses hooked up. Cause, I mean, there's no need. My levels are maintained for the most part. That's amazing. I wasn't doing water changes then either. Where'd you get this tank from? Uh, it was a guy. He was in Las Cruces. Stefan? I don't even remember his name. Got it around March. I paid I think six hundred. Nice. I had to build a stand myself though. Yeah, got it for like six hundred. Jeez, man. Like my favorite fish right here. This little star eye glinny, but there's this monster. Yeah, he's like the biggest one that anybody's ever yeah, seen. Yeah, exactly. Monster. So minus. Since it had to be done anyway, I tried to get it done before you got here, but I didn't make it. Oh, okay. You got clothes. Not clothes. I got those from Kevin. Oh, Kevin got them for me. <laughs> I took his whole lot. That's cool, guys. I'm gonna have to bust out each. These are my gel filters. Looks, looks nice. Yeah, I'm nice. likely gonna change at five. It's gonna go strictly blue. 
Blue, all blue, yeah. Are you running like any controllers on your tank, or? Yeah, I got an Apex. It's right there. What do you think about the new Apexes? I was, are you on the forums or? Uh, not yet, but I was looking into getting it. This tank is freaking. You've been walking all the way back and barely fitting your tank. So, what are you going to do when you have to move? I would sell it. The fun of starting over again would probably intrigue me. Yeah. Not to mention, I told myself I wanted to go SPS. Uh, I'm starting to mess around with the SPS. I just did an order with um, Reefer's Grudge, but they raised the price a little bit now. It was like uh, 11 SPS for $100, now it's $125. Yeah. $15, not too bad. Yeah. Let's ship to your house. What the heck is this? It's my toadstool. He was out in the open earlier, but now he's all closed up, all pissed off. I hate that guy. I honestly hate that boy. <laughs> But he's so big, he covers literally that whole area. Yeah, I can imagine it when it's opened up. That Bobby I got that was super blue. I mean, that thing, it looked like a dead rock. It's just coloring up just slowly. And it's only been in there two weeks, maybe. It's coloring up quick. Yeah, it's nice. Dragon sold five years. I got a little piece of that from Saltwater Heaven, like in his ten dollar section, and it's doing good. The Montes are doing good. I said and broke it. <laughs> it it started out as a little bitty, little bitty thing, and it fell off the ledge. Yeah, next time I'm bringing you some. I don't live too far from you. I live right up the street, actually. Come check out my thing. Yeah. I have a 120. I'm trying to get a, a 150 from a SCA because the dimensions are 24 inches deep, but um, five feet uh, five feet long. And then I think it's also 24 tall. And then the GSP that I brought you is not like this. It's like super long. It's like hair. Uh, yeah, yeah, just like yours right there. Which is crazy because that, that long wavy GSP that you have, I didn't know it was would sting the crap out of stuff. Yeah. Dang, man. So I got him in the back next to other stinging cores. Uh -huh. Sure, sting each other. Your pally there. Uh, nice. Yeah, buddy of mine gave me that with a... And it was like... 30 heads on it, maybe. That was like three months ago. And it's just growing and growing and growing. I'm finding new corals almost every day. <laughs> like, you look in here, uh -huh. there's a torch growing in the very, very back. Behind this Fabia, there's a torch. Well, not a torch. Uh, yeah, it is a torch. You see under that rock? Oh, the head right there? Yeah. Okay, yeah. It's just growing right there. There's another one growing right here. There's about 10 or so tentacles on it. But you didn't frag them, they just nope. broke off or whatever? I didn't frag them at all. That torch has been on that corner the whole time. Oh, wow. They got a fish stuck in the over here. There's two green crumbs just stuck in there. They've been in there for months. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. Just left them in there. 
And what are you going to do with that uh, other, what size is that other tank that you have? I guess 240, 30. Is that a 8 footer? 7. 7? This tank is specifically plastic. Jeez. I know on the camera it looks small, but it is not a small fish at all. posted them for sale. I think I saw it. You got an eel in here? Mm-hmm. He comes out and shows his face every now and again. That oh, rock is nice. Actually mushrooms growing under the rock. I have some red mushrooms that new fry. Look you up. I had like one and now there's like a whole bunch of all, all over the place. Dang. He's a beast. Yeah, my favorite fish. It was in a reef. Uh -huh. I had to take him out. It's just it's too big, right? Knock everything over. All the time. Cool, man. Are you going to do a reef for it? Or you said what? Are you going to maybe think about turning that into a reef tank? Or? Uh, I told myself if I'm going to turn it into a reef, it's going to be SPS dominated. It's <laughs> crazy. I've never seen a tank this big. No? Nah, not in nobody's house, man. <laughs> I've seen thousands of gallons in people's houses. In El Paso? Yeah. On the west side. Oh, okay. Yeah, probably why. I live on the rich and rich side. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Right there? Yeah, you cover up nice. Yeah, he is nice. Let's go and get some color. Make it black coral. When I go to the stores, I'll, if I do go to the stores, I'll make sure to turn the white lights off. And then I'll buy them. Do you carry a blue flashlight or you make them turn on the blues? No, I make them turn on the blues. Just strictly a tenant. Does that mean by the time I get off work, that's the only yeah. Sight I see. Yep. It's just tinting, so I would much rather have the the glow than anything. You probably couldn't capture with your camera that glow. Yeah, I can. You wanna do it? I'll get up there. Yeah, I use the gel filters and everything comes out. I built this bar slash stand, so I mean I can actually I'm on it and I'm just fine. That's sweet. Well guys, I hope you liked that video. There's gonna be a second video of D's tank. Uh, beautiful tank. I hope you guys enjoyed that. Uh, and D hooked me up with a frag of some Zoas. Uh, of course I wasn't gonna say no. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Stay tuned for the next one and you guys take care. Thanks guys. <laughs>